Cancers, what's going on? It's your girl here, Miss Hawaii. Welcome to your general love reading for August 14th of 2022. I hope all is well with you guys, your loved ones and your pets. And welcome to Miss Hawaii Tarot. If it's your first time here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. It's good to see you. I am Miss Hawaii, in case you ain't know, now you know. Let's see what's y'all overall theme song message here. Fuck boy. Oh, shit. Emotions by Twista. Some of y'all dealing with a fuck boy or a fuck girl. Don't look at me like that. If it's not you, then it's not you. But the predominant energy. Now, you could also be the fuck boy or the fuck girl, right? <laughs> it says, I don't mean to sound bogus or nothing, but it's the bomb when I be having them cuties thinking I'm in love with them when I'm rubbing them be getting pub with them in the club with them smoking dub with them hugging them freaking them in the tub with them mm. then you got empath narcissist divine feminine it's all about you not about me by tracy spencer some of y'all dealing with somebody Ooh, that's interesting okay let's get your romance messages here romance angel messages all right so cancer if you want a personal reading that information is below in the description box as well as all of my social media information. We can be friends on social media. There's also a link where you can purchase, where you can purchase the extended reading if you're interested in that. I'll talk more about what's in that at the end of this reading, all right? But don't forget to please hit me with the thumbs up, especially if the reading resonates, and leave me a comment if you feel comfortable and let me know how the reading resonates, okay? And of course, don't forget to subscribe and share, tell a friend, like I always say, okay? So let's see, what are your romance angel messages here? Shout out to all my members too. I love you guys so much. Thank you for being members. If you're not a member yet, there's information um, in the description box or you can click the join button below, okay? All right, romance angel messages for you. You got free yourself in reverse. It's time to take back control of your life. Hello, Cancer. Seem like somebody got you all fucking... Ha, ah, wrapped up in them. Caught up in the rapture of the love. It says, stay optimistic about your love life because positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So some of y'all, okay, that's good. Continue staying optimistic. Continue staying positive. But not don't stay optimistic about somebody that's a fuck boy or a fuck girl now. Because <laughs> look, deception. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. Mm -hmm. You heard Kaylee? Even she's like, yo. Even she like, yo. All right, let's see what the uh, Amira Love Oracle deck got for you. What's going on? It looks pretty um, juicy right now, Cancer. I'm not going to lie. Gifts, surprises, presents, openings, or shh. Quiet, stop. Stop. Surprises, presents, openings. Mm. You got some. You got some. Some shit happening in your love life that you're not gonna expect. It's a good card. Gifts are about blessings from the universe. Ice Queen. It says divorcee mother discernment. So a lot of you, especially my female cancers, that's the energy you're embodying. Ice Queen energy. You could actually have been divorced or maybe you, you know, are separated from somebody. You just been through a lot in love. Some of you are actually mothers or fathers. This is you. A lot of you, you, you're being very discerning in your relationships. Friendship, friends, acquaintances and networking. Some of you are dealing with a dark male. Or you could be the dark male. Hey, <laughs> That's interesting. Friendship. Some of you, you and this person not even in a relationship. It could be like a friend thing. They could be keep they could either be keeping you like in a friend zone or but we're gonna see. We're gonna I'm gonna do overall now. I wanna see the overall energy here. What's going on with my Cancerians in love, please, universe? Please show me what I need to see from my Cancerians. What's going on with them in love? Because right now it's looking real juicy. Right now is looking real juicy. Hey, out. What are you doing in there? 
Don't start making all that noise. Let's see. Universe and angel spirit guides, please show me what is going on with my Cancerians overall in love. Let's see what we got for you guys. Oh, Ten of Swords in reverse. Ooh. The Knight of Coins in reverse. Some of you are dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Eight of Cups in reverse. Can't walk away. Five of Wands in reverse. Hierophant in reverse. Mm. Some of you dealing with a Taurus, heavy Taurus energy. Seven of Wands in reverse. Your overall energy, 10 of Coins. Ooh. Okay. So maybe some of you are in a relationship with this person, with your overall energy being the 10 of Coins. You could be for some of you. Um, but your person ain't giving you enough. That's what it feels like. And the hierophant is in reverse. So there could be issues with commitment. Now, if you and this person are not in a relationship, excuse me, I feel like, I feel like you're trying to approach this in a, in a way where you don't want fighting. You don't want drama. Like you're trying to, you know what I mean? You're trying to keep it peaceful. You're trying to heal the connection. I feel like even there could be even things that this person has done that you really wasn't fucking with. You know what I mean? But you still kind of like, and it could have even hurt you, but you still like forgave them or forgave the situation. Like I'm here for some of you, this person stood you up before they did something about standing you up. Like there was some, there was something special y'all had planned or y'all were supposed to do or something they were supposed to do for you. And they, they didn't show up basically. Okay. Now that's not for everybody, but for a few of you cancers, I'm picking up on that. And I feel like you even forgave them for that. You know what I mean? Like, and that was big. If it was anybody else, you would have cut this person off. But I feel like you, it's hard for you to walk away from this person because I can see their energy. I don't know if they, if they work a lot or if they're just more focused on work or trying to get their money together or something like that. And that could be what's kind of stopping it because the Hierophant in reverse means like a non-traditional relationship or a non-traditional connection. So it could even be for some of you issues. Maybe, you know, one person wants a relationship, the other one doesn't. One person wants marriage, the other one doesn't. Either way, it doesn't seem like you're, you're, you're walking away from this. It seems like you want to commit to this person, but I don't know if they're giving you that same energy. Some of you, it's a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Let's look individually here. Very interesting. Whoever this is, you have a very strong friendship bond with them. Whether you guys are together or not, I see a strong friendship bond. It could even be like maybe you met this person through networking or some type of way you guys help each other through networking or you met through acquaintances or something like that. But either way, I see you and this person are really like have a good friendship as well. You know, and that's important. Like some, sometimes people get mad when you talk about friendship, but I'm like, you should want to be best friends with the person you're dealing with, which, you know what I mean? You just want to fuck them. So, yeah. All right, let's see. Please show me what feelings does cancer have towards this person? What are the feelings that cancer has towards this person here? What feelings does cancer have? Page of Swords in reverse. Mm -mm. Some of you dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. Oh my God, Ten of Cups. Six of Wands. You want this bad, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you want this bad, yeah, 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 yeah. Some of you may even have kids with this person, few of you, but if you don't, you want them. You could definitely see yourself having a family and all that with this person. 
some of y'all, this person gets a lot of attention. They could be in the public eye. I feel like you give them a good amount of attention too. Mm. Judgment. Yeah, you want this person. Point blank, period. Page of cups. Somebody might even be pregnant. You want this person, baby. You can see yourself having your family. You know what I mean? Having that, y'all living together. If you don't already, you know, and wow. But the page of swords is in reverse. So I don't know. You're seeing your person like in a different light. Let's see. What feelings does this person have towards you? Hmm. Four of Pentacles. Uh -uh. Oh, they in this shit, huh? Two of Swords. <laughs> they not as sure. They not as with it like you, because you like with it. They like. Mm. There's a little bit of some, indis, you know, indecisiveness here with this person. I see them holding back, but they do see the value in this, in you. One more card for this person's feelings towards cancer. Holding on. Page of coins in reverse. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Some of y'all, this person could be younger than you. Y'all mutual energy is the king of cups. There's love here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. There's love here. And it's mutual. It's mutual. That's great. But death, Scorpio. Some of you dealing with a Scorpio or a Virgo. Let's clarify these. Because I don't like that both pages are in reverse. That's the only thing I'm like, huh? And in your persons, even though there's love between the two of you, they still got this energy of, I don't know, let's, let's see. Show me the page of swords in reverse here. Clarify this. Queen of wands. Damn, you really attracted to this person. And some of you be spying on him and shit. Oh, some of y'all, you in a same sex connection. Okay. Um, because there's two queens here. So some of y'all in the same sex connection. Oh, you and this person are very different. Very different. Very different. I feel like you got this strong attraction for this person, but you also got your guard up. Let me see the Ten of Cups. Emperor. Damn. Some of y'all like, yo, I want this to be my baby daddy or my baby father, my baby mama. <laughs> the devil. You obsessed, boy. Two of swords in reverse. Cancer like, I made up my mind. I already know how I feel. I already know. Cancer like, I know this my person. I love it. Cancer like, I know. I know. I know this is my person. Ooh, child. Let me see the six of wands. Ooh, some of y'all, this a, a Capricorn. If you live with this person, though, it's just some toxic shit going on in the home, though. That You know what I mean? Let me see this six of wands. 
King of Cups. You love the fuck out of this person. That's you. Yep. Page of Pentacles. Damn. Ten of Pentacles. Damn. You love the fuck out of this person. And you want this. It confuses you sometimes, though. Why you love them so much? Show me the judgment. You love the fuck out of this person. Queen of Cups. You love the fuck out of this person. Now we got the king and the queen here. Interesting. Oh, yeah. You love this person so much, you willing to put up with they shit. You love this person so much, you are willing to put up with they shit. Ten of Pentacles again. Because some of y'all, this person got drama in their life. And you still, or they created drama in your life. And you still fucking with them. You still, this person is still in your heart space. You love the fuck out of this person. You got the king and queen of cups here. That's showing all the love. Shit. Yo, I'm done with you. Let's go to your person now. Why the four coins for this person? The lovers in reverse. Damn. Gemini energy. Eight of swords in reverse. Mm. This could be a Gemini, someone you connecting with. This person, they trying not to be all stuck on you, whoever this is. They don't want to be stuck on you. They don't want this connection to grow. They're scared. Some of you, they feel like if they if they allow this connection to grow, it's gonna you're gonna always be in their head. They're gonna feel stuck. This person don't want to be stuck. Show me the two of swords, like how you are. <laughs> the eight of wands in reverse. Uh oh, they might not even be talking to you right now. Some of you, they blocking our communication. Some of you, they waiting on you or to communicate. What the fuck. Let me see the um. Yeah, four swords just dropped in my lap. This person could be like taking time to themselves right now. They could be taking time to heal or sometimes the four swords is just like a mental break. Let me see the ace of coins, please, universe. Thank you, angels. I just want to be the fool. Okay, Aries energy. Show me the ace of coins. The moon in reverse. With the high priestess. So this person is, is, I think they're keeping a lot from you about the way they feel. Um, yeah, they're not, they're not being honest with you about their feelings, whoever this is. Because I feel like they see the potential in you. But with the high priestess, it's like they're thinking about it. Like they may not be revealing that to you and telling you because the Ace of Pentacles is something solid, right? They may eventually with the moon in reverse want to, you know, say, let me open up and tell you. But this person is trying to like, for some reason, like they're trying to close themselves off a little bit. Let me see the page of coins in reverse. The Empress. Wow. Six of Wands. You see what I'm saying? It's like y'all both on this shit. Like y'all both want this shit really bad. And they see you as the Empress. So this person, <laughs> the attraction is crazy between the two of you. Be careful if y'all are having sex because... Excuse me, if one of you can end up pregnant, it will happen. 
but y'all both really, really, really want this. I just feel like your energy is more like, I want this. Like you really like in your feelings, feelings. They ain't their feelings too, but they a little bit more reserved. Like they're not as like, you know what I mean? Obsessed as you, because you getting a devil energy. But I'm not getting a devil in a bad way. This person is just kind of like, Like they may be even trying to put the brakes on it for a minute. You know what I mean? But they do fuck with you. And there is mutual energy and energy of love here. Nine of swords in reverse and peace here. Like I feel like the two of you give each other a certain type of peace. When you know there's, they like that. Something about the company that the two of you keep together. Okay. And that's, that's important, you know? Um, so let's go into the extended now. So what I want to do is in the extended I want to take a look at this person's future actions towards you. Uh, we'll see what you can expect from them, all right, moving forward. And then we'll also go ahead and um, pull you some oracle cards, okay, so we can see what your advice is as far as love and moving forward with this person. Um, I also want to look at this person's subconscious. Let me see. I'm going to use the hidden truth messages here. So I'll pull three of these, okay, and then I'll go ahead and reveal them in the extended. So if you guys would like to join me there, the link is in the description box below, all right? It'll take you over to Vimeo, okay? If not, thanks for watching. I appreciate your love and support. You guys are awesome. Please don't forget to hit me with the like button. If the reading resonated, I would greatly appreciate it. Leave me a comment if you feel comfortable, subscribe and share all that good stuff. I love you guys. Thanks for all that you do, all your support. I'll see you guys in the extended. And if not, I'll see you guys next time. Enjoy your Sunday. Bye, Cancer.